Hi there, I'm Elliot Napier, a product development engineer here at ECS. Uh, I'm sitting here at our engineering office in Los Angeles, California. Um, and I wanted to show you a really cool product that we've been working on recently. So if you are looking to uh, maximize your 5G performance with edge, cloud, and point of presence, if you're looking for something that is secure, integrated, and seamless, then uh, I would like to show you this. This is our ECS edge connected device. This is a new technology from us here at ECS. It facilitates high-speed 5G connectivity for various applications. Uh, it can serve as a bridge between your local networks and your devices, or as a broader connection out to the internet uh, and the cloud services. So this will provide you with enhanced operational efficiency, high-end performance, versatility across multiple use cases, simplified network integration, and elevated security. So this product here that I'm showing, you can see it has dual SIM connections over here, has four 5G antennas, which are these at the back, two Wi-Fi antennas at the front. This provides inbound and outbound Wi-Fi connections. So you can connect out to Wi-Fi connections from this, or you can have this create its own Wi-Fi hotspot that you can then connect into. It has multiple Ethernet ports on the other side here, SFP plus and standard RJ45 ports all along the back, as well as a console connection for any programming that might need to be done, a couple of USB ports and a very simple 12 volt power connection here. So this particular device is running an Intel Atom C3558 CPU. That's a four core. There is eight core options available. So you get to choose between cost efficiency or simply just higher performance. Um, this allows for multi-core processing, very hard, a very low um, power utilization here. So very power efficient. Um, this also is provided with the Zscaler Zero Trust Exchange from Zscalers. There's two ways you can do that either using a Zscaler SIM or running any regular SIM that you would like to use to connect up to whichever 5G provider you're using uh, and install the Zscaler branch connector on the device, which will be done for you by ECS. And that will allow you to connect up to your uh, Zero Trust uh, branch connector account through Zscaler up to your own Zero Trust exchange in their cloud before connecting to the public internet to keep you secure. So setup here is very simple. Um, as I showed you, we have the single power connection and we have a single ethernet connection here, which is what my laptop is currently connected to. So if I share my screen with you here, what you'll be able to see is that we are connected over this LAN port here. We are not connected over Wi-Fi that is disconnected at the moment. And here is what we will be seeing from a network standpoint. So this is my laptop connected over the ethernet port. Note that we could be connected over the Wi-Fi connection. If we had that outbound connection configured and ready to go, the device itself is then connected up to the Zscaler Zero Trust Exchange. In this situation, we're using the Zscaler SIM, so no need for any branch connector, application uh, in the virtual machine running on the device. And then from there, we're connected out to the public internet. So here we can see, if you go to your Chrome and were to type in ip.zscaler.com to check this, you can see that we are currently connected in through the Dallas One um, server from Zscaler. Um, gives us our server IP, gives us our proxy IP. Um, no authentication here uh, because we are using the SIM rather than the branch connector. So we're not connected to our account in any sense. We are connected up to the general Zscaler Zero Trust Exchange. Uh, again, if we check with what is my IP.com, we will see that we are connected over IPv4 to the Dallas location and our internet service provider in this case is Zscaler. And realistically, uh, what you're gonna be using this with is, as I mentioned, the Zscaler SIM itself, uh, which will not require your account. You'll do that all on the back end on your Zscaler dashboard. If you already have an account, uh, we will help you set this up if it's your first time using Zscaler or use whichever SIM you'd like. If you have a contract um, with a 5G provider or there's simply one that you prefer, one that gets you better coverage on your area, Go ahead and use them. We will set up the Zscaler branch connector on the device for you. Same situation, plug it into the wall, plug it into your laptop or POS system, whichever device you plan to be using it with, turn it on. The connections will happen seamlessly on the back end on your dashboard, connect that up to your account. That will connect up to your Zero Trust Exchange and you have internet provided at your location, uh, fully secured by Zscaler. This is available from ECS. ECS designs, builds, and deploys digital infrastructure with a customer-first approach. So do not think this is all we do. Anything from 
small edge devices such as our edge connector all the way up to full rack and stack cluster integration, whatever you need. Um, for more information on this, as well as everything else we do, go ahead and visit equuscs.com. That's uh, E-Q-U-U-S-C-S.com. And we will see you there.